Police officials in Utah revealing brand new body camera footage of Gabby Petito and Brian Laundrie during a suspected domestic incident. Phil Keating has the latest on this incident and the search for Laundrie. Newly released body cam footage shed some light on the troubled relationship between Gabby Petito and Brian Laundrie. Petito told a Utah police officer that Laundrie hit her after police responded to a call back in August about a possible domestic violence incident involving the couple. He just grabbed you? Did he did he hit you though? I mean, I mean it's okay if you're saying you hit him and then I, I understand if he hit you, but we want to know the truth if he actually hit you. I guess, you know, I guess, yeah, but I can first. Where did he hit you? The search for laundry is intensifying here in Northport, Florida. The FBI returned to the family home Thursday where they collected personal items and inspected a camper parked outside the residence. An attorney representing the laundry family told Fox News the evidence will assist canines during the FBI's ongoing investigation. Meanwhile, TV celebrity Dwayne Chapman, a.k.a. Dog the Bounty Hunter says he has received thousands of tips as he focuses his search on a state park in Tampa Bay where the family camped out in early September. So these dogs are incredible. They went through all this. It took me an hour to go through it. it. took that dog five minutes. So that really helps. Some say the presence of a high profile figure like Chapman may be beneficial in the search for laundry. His notoriety, he's got a name. You know, people get drawn to that stuff and may, you know, give him information. The FBI is now in possession of a cell phone purchased by Brian Laundry in the days before his disappearance. Laundry's attorney says this was not a burner phone that are untraceable, but one registered with AT&T. In Northport, Florida, Phil Keating, Fox News.